hello guys uh, welcome back to my channel i'm nora maroba your host and if you are the first time joining this channel i give you the warm welcome and thank you very much my people for your subscription for your views and your comments they really appreciate it and i love you all and i hope you're doing fine wherever you are in today's video uh we're just going to be sharing the household tips that i have or i got and i've been practicing them in my eyes household and they're working wonderfully so so i thought i should share with you guys maybe some of you guys got frustrated and don't know what to do however this is what i thought you should share and maybe you we will learn and uh also share your ideas on how to improve uh, or on the tips that i'm having maybe you guys have more that you can share with me and to um, improve all together in uh, the kitchen tips that i'm having we're going to be using only two products and these products they are affordable found everywhere and very cheap and they are easy to get so the first product that i'm going to be talking about is this handy nd the handy nd cream uh the lemon and fresh uh one this one uh is very much useful in our household with this one uh, i'm using it over a number of things first of all i'm using it as a stain remover it works wonders as a stain remover on your fabrics whatever uh, the fabrics that you have and it does not uh, change the color or ma the, leave a mark on your fabrics on your clothes on your uh, 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 whatever uh, surface that you have used so if you have some stains on any fabric that you have you just put a drop of it and rub it a little bit on the uh, 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 on the uh, fabric uh be it the oil stain be it food stain the curry stain um the beetroot the whatever the stain that you might think of i've used it and i'm using it i normally don't run short of it and the best thing about it is that most in most shops it goes like buy two for 60 rand three for 90 rand this and it's a bargain to me i always grab them so you use them on any of the stains on your clothing and it will remove that stain um hundred percent it will remove that stain and you will love your clothes what i like it doesn't change the color or leave a mark like maybe if you're using jig you know jig it has selective uh on the color some clothes they might uh get uh stained forever but with this one it's a no we you use it anywhere and again i'm using it on the kitchen tops the kitchen uh surfaces on your stove it's working wonders it's working you just put it you just sprinkle it on the tops and then you use your sponge in water and the sponge is good because it doesn't scratch the surface so you just wipe a little bit with it then the stains will go and the oil and fats it's 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 and your area will remain clean it will remain beautiful with this one and at times when i don't have the tile cleaner i use it in water i use it in water for scrubbing remember it has got lemon inside and if you know you know about the lemon it has got lemon inside so it's able to 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 clean so this is the a uh, tip that i'm sharing with you today that this handy any and please don't go for the other ones they do have other ones in store uh with different names and the, the others are pinkish in color the others no i 
specifically mean this one. It's so good. I love it. It's always in my household. So it cleans. It does laundry as well if you did not know. So always have it. And then the other one that I'm going to be talking about today is this the vinegar spirit vinegar the white vinegar uh not the black one they we do have the black vinegar but i'm talking about this white one uh this is simply because uh it's also not expensive this one it's never expensive it's two this is two liter for 26 27 rand in sa um and with this one it doesn't matter the brand doesn't matter the brand as long as it's white vinegar i also buy in wherever um supermarket i found myself in and this one i uh, first of all i use it for my laundry too uh i use this cap uh i use three quarter of this cap into the laundry i'm using the 18 kg machine so i just pour into this cap and into the water with my washing powder and then uh it's the purpose of it it's going to suck in the order unnecessary order from the the clothes uh sometimes it might find it's the sweat order sometimes it's the mold order you keep things for a long time and when especially the linens and towel and when you want to use them they've got this mold or cupboard uh stay smell so when you're using this um vinegar it's going to suck that sm smell when you wash because you you we, we were just wondering or i just washed these things but when you iron they bring out that smell so with this vinegar i found a friend in it it does no longer bring that smell when you iron your fire you you smell the aroma of the sea soft that you are using so i'm using it in my laundry when doing laundry and i think it will depend on the kind of the water content that you are having then you just pour a little bit not too much because it's acidic it will work uh, not too much and again the other purpose is that it, it 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 also doesn't stain on 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 your clothes but i can give you a tip that uh, it is advisable that uh to pour it in water before and and stay to and dilute it a bit before you pour in uh put in your clothes so it also makes your color remains uh the same like there are these fabrics that were inside water using the washing powder you say ah this washing powder has got the tendency of um removing the color of the clothes so with this one i think it neutralizes that uh in water and then your clothes will remain white the blue will remain blue uh, the red will remain red and i also find it useful also in the linen because um the linen uh and the sheets that we buy from certain shops like pep uh, uh they normally have the, the 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 this thing of decoloring find it even coloring water and later when you check it it looks old does no longer look new so with this one it makes your your, your fabrics to remain the color content to remain there and also that they do not dye each other in water i find some other when they are decoloring they dye others but never mix the white with the other colors when doing our laundry that is the the, the norm to say you white you white separately and the other colors are uh, uh, separate so this bottle it's also a secret that I wanted to share with you today. And also in your uh, mopping or scrubbing, floor scrubbing water, you add a little bit. Uh, you've put in your tile cleaner. If you don't have a tile cleaner, you put this together with your 
your handy endy it gonna work wonders they gonna work wonders so in your 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 water for scrubbing it also makes the tile shine. believe me the shining from this i just don't know and again i tried it on the mirrors you know when you're wiping your mirrors you find they making this cloudy thing that you don't understand that you don't want and you want the mirrors to be shiny so you just put a little bit in the water that uh in the water and use a clean uh, cloth and wipe your mirrors with and then another white cloth to vanish it it's working wonders so even on the floors it's the it's it makes in the floors to shine it keeps them shiny and it's also chasing away the flies in the house it's also chasing away the flies uh, in the house when you have uh, mopped with it in your water uh be for the next 24 hours there won't be flies flies in your house and because of this acids in this it's also good for your pen your bend pots and pens uh if you have bent food and uh, in your pots and before you using too much power scrubbing 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 you just put this uh vinegar and with the handy handy of course uh in water and water in your pot and leave it overnight the following day you will see it's not gonna uh, uh, have that difficulty removing the pen uh, marks from the pot and again it sucks they suck in the 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 smell of the pen in the in in the pots and pen and your pens then they are nicely and ready to use so guys these were the tips that i wanted to share with you today and hope we will try them at home and comment again in the comment box with your experiences that will be highly much appreciated and uh these are the two products that i want that they are my friends and what i like they are cheap they are cheap and can do multi-purpose at our homes so thank you very much guys for watching and if you like this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe share and comment and your support is highly valued I love you till we meet again thank you bye bye